uh, Ed and Roger and I just like woodshed it and practiced a lot and had a lot of fear, a lot, had a lot of fun. Well, working with Sergi was a complete fucking headache. No, I'm kidding. Uh, I've, I've known Sergi for 20 years and um, that Where You've Been and Dinosaur Jr. was a big connector for him and I. So Sergi's like a brother of mine. We've made records together and toured the world together. So it was, you know, him and I have a good working relationship. I got involved in this uh, after talking to Sergi. He told me that he was recording Where You Been in its entirety and he, he asked me if I wanted to sing a couple of songs and I thought why not, I've always been a huge dinosaur fan so it might be fun to slay a couple of songs. Between Sergi, Eddie and I, we uh, did pretty much everything together, learning the songs, jamming them out and we all had equal say in what happens in, in the recording process. Like anytime you're for, you learn somebody else's songs, it definitely like opens up your your headspace for like what is possible in music that's not you know in line with your own ideas. I think it's like really healthy to learn other people's music. Where you been? That record changed my life quite dramatically. I love that record. You know, you can't see the forest for the trees when you're recording your stuff, typically, because it's like you're you're my so poetic. You're 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 micro you're micro focus, you know. So. You're oh wow, the recording process with fell trees. Uh, yeah, it was um, very solitary because I did it by myself, and um, I really don't know much about uh, recording in general, so uh, it was all a surprise. This is Toki. Sergi, the ringleader's favorite member. Well, what does he do in the band? Toki? He kind of just runs around and annoys people when they're trying to uh, do some serious takes and barks. He's a general spirit lifter. 